Hello again, I'm back. Um, I thought I'd come on to do a little update, especially when last night I realised it's been more than six months um, since I actually did a video. So I am sorry I've not really posted much. Um, just trying to think. So I think the last video was the start of the lockdown um, and I'd just been reprogrammed. Um, had some improvements, but um, not really what I'd hoped for. Obviously couldn't do anything during lockdown. Um, and then when things eased up, um, I went in to be reprogrammed. I think that was in June time. Um, and unfortunately I didn't have much luck. Um, it was fine to start with. And then I started to experience um, like a backache in my lower back, uh, which was really uncomfortable. And did a little bit of a test by turning off, uh, kind of giving it a few days, uh, seeing how when and then turning it back on again and seeing if it returned and it did uh, so ended up getting reprogrammed again going back in turns out the previous program uh, it was on a high kind of a high level setting so that may have been why it caused me that discomfort but very bizarre but I, th I think it can happen at times so they set me up on a new program which is the one that I'm currently on um and I'm frustrated to say that I'm still really not seeing the results that I'd hoped. I mean, maybe a little bit, uh, but nothing in comparison to, to when I had the trial, um, which is really frustrating and really annoying. Um, but I'm hoping either I can get reprogrammed again or the last discussions were that um, they could possibly look at doing a wire reset just to check um that obviously the wire hadn't moved um they did actually do an x-ray uh, let me rewind they did an x-ray uh, a couple of months ago um to have a look and just with everything that i was feeling they kind of thought that it was in the right place but i don't know it's it's really annoying um i mean it's not so bad at the moment because i'm in lockdown i'm at home my toilet's right there um i can use it whenever i want there's no stress no worries uh, but kind of before when you could get out and about, I mean, I'm sure, you know, people watching were experiencing the same things, but going out and about could be, it was quite difficult because toilets weren't always open and in shops where there would be a toilet available, they were closed. Um, so yeah, it came, became a bit of an issue on a few occasions, but um, we always managed to, to find a way around it. But anyway, um, so yeah, that, that's, the latest update i'm sorry i haven't got anything more more to share and i wish i had more positive news to share but i think this is quite unusual um from what i've been told you know it is a bit of a mystery as to why it's not working it's just yeah it's really annoying i mean how it can it literally fixed me um during the trial and I just don't understand why I just can't get that back again. Um, I have good days, bad days, but mainly it's just it's just the same. And I, I did have a couple of really good days, but again, like I just, I don't, and that's when I thought it may have been starting to work, but then I went bad again. So yeah, it's all a bit of a mystery, really. One bit of advice um, for anybody that goes to, you know, has the, the permanent device done and for your trial as well, is to maybe just get a notepad and write down everything that you feel. So when you have the trial, write down kind of if you're feeling sensations in certain places, write that down, where you're feeling them, how they're feeling. Um, and again, when you get programmed with the permanent because I think where I've been programmed quite a few times now, it's really hard to think back to, oh, did I feel this last time? Does this feel different? It's just quite hard to differentiate between all those different sensations I've had with different programs. Um, and I really wish I'd, I'd done that from the start. I mean, I do clearly remember how it felt during the trial. And I think that's kind of what I'm always chasing. And this current program's probably the closest sensation wise, but I don't think it's really a about that there's obviously more to it um so yeah write it down uh notepad everything that you're feeling and where basically charging wise is really good at the moment um on the current program i'm on um i swear it's like three and a half weeks since um charging previously so it's 
it's really good but the program that i had before um that was causing me back pain that was lasting like three days um and then it was flashing green so that was obviously a very high setting and draining the battery uh but no all of the other ones i've got have been really good like you know two and a half three weeks and now i think pretty longer than three weeks um so it's really good charging flashing amber i meant to say flashing amber i'm still using the belt to, to charge i think previously i mentioned that i have been using the sticky pads uh, but i found a way to master wearing the belt um basically just with a really big pair of pants um, and just kind of putting it on at a bit of an angle putting my big pants on pulling my trousers over the top of it um obviously not too many layers because you don't want it to warm up um, but just so it keeps it firmly in place and stops it becoming disconnected. Um, before I said I was using the sticky pads to um, obviously avoid it becoming disconnected, but actually the belt's much easier. Um, it's, you know, it's not a single use piece. It's something I can use all the time. Um, so it's much better for the environment as well, which is always a plus. So I hope everyone's um, keeping well. Obviously it's still a really weird time at the moment and really frustrating for anybody who had had the procedure booked in or um, trials booked in and that's all been pushed back and there's probably going to be a bit of a backlog uh, which is a bit of an a bit annoying um but it is what it is um and i figure that's also annoying in my case because if i do have to get a wire reset it's probably not going to be for quite some time so i'm quite keen to carry on trying um new programs and hope that i might <laughs> find one that works i think i've probably worked through about seven now um and if i'm correct i think there's 11 in total different configurations that you can have so we shall see what happens um in the next few months but i think the thing for me to remember is at the end of the day i'm not getting worse um and I've maybe had somewhat improvement. Oh, I don't know about that, but um, but yeah. So just trying to stay positive, really. Um, and yeah, we shall see how how things go. I'll do another another video. Um, hopefully not in six months' time. Hopefully before to scream and shout and tell you it's working and it's amazing. Uh, because it really is. When it works, it's just incredible. It's life changing. And yeah, I I'm excited for anybody who's going for the trial or going to get the procedure done because I know it works um, and you should be excited as well. So please don't get put off by um, my videos. I think I'm just a bit of a, a rare situation. Um, it never really is that straightforward with me, I don't think. But fingers crossed, keep positive, um, stay well. And yeah, if anyone um, has any comments, just drop them below. Um, but yeah, speak to you soon.